Welcome back in the post game. Jeff Blankman joined right now by Sam Eifler, the head coach for the Coon Rapids Bayer Crusaders. And coach, you got to be pretty happy. This is the team that uh, got you in your own tournament a, a match. You didn't feel like you guys played your best tonight. Had to be pretty close. Yeah, uh, we were really excited when we gave right away just because, like you said, they took the championship from us. Fell down early in that first game. Got down, I think, if I remember right, by as many as five. What was going wrong early on? Uh, I think they were just nervous a little bit. They were really pumped up, but sometimes that kind of nerves get the best of them. So we just had to calm down a little bit. We had to control the learning to battle where we were going to be easy. I thought maybe it was all that pre study and for pre calc for the oh, test coming up tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know, but uh, they settled in, and, and once you guys started passing the ball, and then the serves came on. Yeah, um, once, yeah, once we started passing the ball, because they're hard servers, you know, and once we got that ball up, anytime we get a perfect pass, we always get a kill from that. So we always have to tell them to remind them to get a pass and play, and that's exactly what they do to get a pass up, and kind of sets a great ball and a great runner with offense on it, and it, I think that's what they do. And tonight in the pregame, you were kind of talking about the defense they like to play. How did you guys figure out how to attack it tonight, and did it work the way you wanted it to? It did. Uh, we told them that we're going to need to run a lot of quicks because they're super scrappy. And if we get quicks, they're going to throw a lot. Also, we noticed that they had, and don't be afraid to just dump it somewhere where they're not. They just have to come the ball every time, and that's exactly what they did. I think you guys had another superstar create herself tonight. Caitlin Culbertson yeah. had a really good night for you guys. I thought between the three games tonight, you had a lot of different players at some point or another came in and made plays for you. Danielle Schwartz takes one off the exactly. forehead. It turned into a perfect pass off the forehead. Yeah, the girls were, like I said, they're everywhere tonight. They're playing their hearts out. This is the game they really wanted. So like you said, they all stepped up and did something for the team. Game, you guys come back, you take a 25-23 victory in that first game. Game number two, you just rolled from the get-go. Yeah, and it was funny because right before that game, I said, there's no way we're going to make clean up these guys. So we had one point and then we ended up kind of sweeping up in that second game. But, you know, we knew coming in the third game that still was going to be easy. And it wasn't just a battle, but those were the exciting games we were playing. Fell behind in that third game, got down, I think, again by five. What turned around for you in the third one? I'm not really sure, actually. I was getting nervous. I was getting ready to call a timeout, and then we had one really big kill, and that just got their momentum up. And then, like I said, really Cook was struggling a little bit with her running, so she was smart up there and finding those spots, and she was getting really strong So, it was being smart with her play and being the end of the years. How did you feel like you played in the back row tonight? Awesome. Our defense was all over the place, way better than the last time we played them. Um, I think that's kind of because we were prepared, you know. We knew that when we needed to step up, we needed to go back, and they were all over the place. So I was very impressed with the scrimmage. Coach, did you have much to say to the girls uh, in the locker room for post game? Um, no, actually, they're super excited, so they're just running all over the place. So we'll have to have a nice little chat with them afterwards. But they're excited, so we're just letting them enjoy that for now. Sandra, they got a big tournament down in Guthrie Center. What are you looking for down there? Uh, we're, we actually are going to be missing three of our players, two of our seniors are going to be gone. It's going to be hard for us, but we're just hoping that we're able to come out on top of our pool and hopefully, you know, we're going to have some good competition if we like that. So we're looking forward to see how we're able to do it because of what we're missing. So some of the other girls are going to step up. Well, Coach, congratulations. A well-deserved victory tonight and a dominant performance. Yes, thank you very much. Head Coach Sam Eifler again with the Coon Rapids Baird Crusade.